What is up guys? Today I'm talking about how to increase revenue for your SMMA business in 2021. So I actually made a video about this um, a few weeks back in Maurice's mastermind that I'm in. For those of you who don't know, I'm in Maurice Gear's ICP mastermind. So every Friday we'll do a training and I actually posted one of my trainings from that uh, mastermind on my YouTube channel. And there was one slide specifically where I was talking about something very important. And I think I really didn't make that big of enough deal for this section that I'm talking about. Because what I'm about to show you is gonna change what you're doing now. It's gonna show you how to really increase your revenue, how to start hitting those sales goals that you're trying to hit. So it all comes down to numbers. And this is something that you're gonna have to you know, do on your own. You have to do your own research, right? However you do outreach, you know, what are your numbers? How much outreach does it take you to get an appointment? And then from there, you have to understand how many appointments does it take for you to get a closed deal? So we're gonna go over that. So first thing again, we're gonna be doing calls. And this, with this we'll just basically label outreach. We'll set appointments and then close deals. So just like this. So now again, this is gonna be different for everybody. So that's why it's so important that you have to take action and that way you can start measuring yourself to hit those sales goals that you wanna hit. So for example, for me, if I talk to, if I dial rather, if I, cause for those of you who don't know, the only outreach methods I do are cold calling and LinkedIn. So again, it's gonna be different for every platform, however, however you do it. But for me, if I dial 200 times, I'll be able to set three appointments. Oh my God, my handwriting. Wow, it's so bad on a Mac. 200 dials, right, for three appointments. And typically, if I talk to three people who are interested, I'm gonna close one. So these are my numbers, right? So from here, I can start calculating, you know? How many clients do I wanna close this month, right? So for example, for me, if I wanted to close 10 deals, I now know what I have to do to get there. So that means I would have to, you know, make 2,000 dials, get 30 appointments, and you know, if I'm in that range of one out of three, then I should be able to close 10 deals, right? So we're basically just adding a zero to every single one of these. And that's how simple it is, really, and that's what you gotta do. Do you think, personally, that you can dial 2,000 times in a month? Okay, it's definitely possible. I know a lot of people who are doing three to 500 dials a day a day, okay? So they're obviously a lot more aggressive as far as their goals go, but you know, you and me, we're just starting out. And I just wanna make this clear for anybody who doesn't know, if you wanna really start growing this thing so you can finally quit your job and get out of the life that you hate, this is how you have to do it. You can just literally do the math and the numbers tell you it's just gonna happen. But first of all, you have to know what your numbers are. For you, it could be, you know, you close one out of four. You close, you know, typically if you make 200 dials, you'll get one appointment. Maybe you'll get 10 appointments, whoever, you know, whatever it is for you. You have to first find out what those numbers are. Once you know those numbers, then you can really start to scale it and it'll just start taking off. So for me, like, you know, I, I actually have clients that are now retaining because when I first started, you know, I had a horrible white label and none of my clients wanted to stick around. They were done after the first month. So now I'm actually starting to get clients to retain and I'm, I'm keeping clients on top of building more clients. So I'm literally almost at a point where I'm doubling my business per month as like from this month to last month, it's, you know, I'm probably gonna get, you know, almost double what I did just by understanding these numbers and really, you know, doing the math for myself. So do the math for yourself, whichever platform you're on, whether you're on LinkedIn, whether you're doing cold calls, cold email, do the numbers, get really solid on what your KPIs are, your key point indicators. And once you understand those numbers, again, you can literally just kill it. And this is stuff that I teach my appointment setters every single morning at 7 a.m. Pacific, we are on the phone and doing role plays. And I tell them the same thing, guys, my appointment setters, I pay them $50 of bonus every time they get me one to close. So I tell them, if you can get me three appointments per day, you can get one bonus. So what's that gonna take? You know, for some of my agents, it's gonna take, you know, um, you know, three hours to get three appointments. Other other guys, it'll take 30 minutes. So it really just depends on you, you know? Understand what your numbers are. It's different for every single person. Like, that's why I gave you the example of my appointment setters, because even they are different. 
you know my appointment setters have different skills so they have different numbers in themselves um, and that goes a little bit more higher level when you start managing people you can start to understand you know individual numbers as opposed to just yours but since we're just starting to get our agency started we're gonna focus on our own numbers so you know find out what it is are you doing looms are you doing cold calls start taking action and writing down what all your results are you should have a basic CRM if you don't have one there's so many free CRMs out there that you can use so you know just get down to it and you can really understand what your numbers are so hope you guys found that valuable this is something again that I really started implementing this month in February and it's just literally almost doubled my business doing this and uh, anyways guys I hope that was valuable if you like this video please give it a like we got 40 likes on the last video so I'm gonna be dropping another cold uh, excuse me, another closing call video just for you guys because the I think the first video I was like 25 likes you guys killed the like button The last video I was like if we get 40 likes you guys literally killed the love like button in, in one week I think the deadline was two weeks you guys killed it So I'm gonna be dropping another one of those videos for you guys and I see you guys. Thanks for watching